What's up my darlings, welcome back to Mass Effect 3. So last time we did Priority Perseus Veil, vale, which was a nice reunion with the Quarians, well, some of them. We at least got to see Tali, it was amazing, I was so happy to see her, but then we had to discuss the subject at hand, which was the Quarians starting a war. Right now, while the Reapers are invading. Guys, worst possible time for this to be happening. We had to help get them out of a really hairy situation and we went in there and we found Legion. He'd been snatched by the Reapers and was in a David scenario and I was very upset. Thankfully, we got him out of there. We got Tali out of there safely. Everything worked out, but it almost didn't because one of the Corian admirals was willing to blow the whole place up with us in it. Don't worry, I punched him in the stomach to make up for it. I feel better now. Today we've had some side missions open up, I think a couple of them are to do with the Quarians, and we have a bunch of things to turn in on the Citadel, so we're going to be taking care of some side missions today. So grab yourself a drink, or a snack, get cosy, and let's get to it. Shall we try to continue with life after finding out that the Quarians have started war on top of the Reapers invading? <sighs> So now we have that to deal with, on top of everything else that we're juggling. It's totally fine. It's even more frustrating seeing that it wasn't like a unanimous decision. Some of them really wanted it, some of them didn't. Things are getting destroyed. Huge amounts of people are dying. And so many people are just determined to continue as normal. It's very akin to current events. It is amazing how little people will care until things impact them directly. It's not until the Reapers are actually physically there killing them that they'll be like, we should have done something. <laughs> it's frustrating. Let's hope that the Crucible works. The Crucible is like what I'm putting all my money on. At least some good came out of all this. We got Tali, we got Legion. All right, my darlings, let's get back into it and boop that any button. Boop. Oh, I'm in my room in front of my fish tank. Ah, uh, see, this is how I need to decompress. After all that stress, after all that nonsense, you know, I may have overreacted just a tad by punching that guy in the stomach, but you know what? He deserved it. I need to chill out a little bit and go and stand in front of my beautifully curated fish tank. Ah, uh, I'm so glad I got the jellyfish. Now that I've stood here for a good few hours calling off from all that, let's take a look at the new missions we got. <laughs> okay, so we have Priority Rannoch, which we're not doing yet. We have Rannoch Geth Fighter Squadrons and we have Rannoch Admiral Chorus. We also have N7 Fuel Reactors. I mean, part of me feels like because Admiral Chorus is ship crash landed, that one seems pretty important. So maybe we should take care of that first. <laughs> Let's read it. The Quarian ship carrying Admiral Chorus crash landed on Rannoch, leaving the civilian fleet without a leader. Land on Rannoch and rescue Admiral Chorus. All right, let's do it. Ah, <sighs> okay. I'm feeling better now. I'm not going to punch anybody today, I think. Let's just get right into it. To the map. Boop. Goodbye, Geth Debris Field. That was, that was certainly a thing. Bye. Oh, here we- oh wow, it's right here. Oh, we didn't have to go very far at all. All right, let's enter orbit. Boop. Let's read about Rannoch. I don't think I've read it before. Although its orange sun is only about 90% the mass of Sol and half as luminous, Rannoch is arid by Earth standards because it formed closer to its star and has slightly less ocean coverage. Photosynthetic life is concentrated around rivers and oceans, with large expanses of desert in between. The importance of plant life and shade in ancient Quarian culture is evident in the translation of Rannoch's name. Walled Garden? Oh, I didn't know that. If I did, I forgot. To a starship sensors, the most obvious feature of the Quarian homeworld is the numerous heat sources in orbit. Thousands of Geth space stations watch over the planet. Somewhere in this artificial swarm of constructions lurks the Geth Armada, waiting for its moment to counterattack. Oh, geez. All right, let's go save the Admiral. All right, so obviously, since we are rescuing a Quarian Admiral, it would be wise to bring Tali 
obviously. Boop. Who should we bring with Tali is the question. We haven't done a girl squad in a minute. The question is, do I do robo girl squad with Edie or do I do OG girl squad with Liara? Ooh, decisions, decisions. I feel like Tali and Edie would have really interesting conversations. It's hard because we have several OGs now. We have Liara, we have Caden, we have Garrus. I mean, Caden is also an OG. He and Tali know each other. That could be a good combination. As much as I want to bring Liara for OG squad, I think the idea of an AI saving the Corian Admiral would be really funny. <laughs> it just tickles me. I've got to do it. I've got to bring Edie. I got to do it for the lols. I got to do it. <laughs> All right, Miss Edie, are you ready to make things awkward? Let's go, sweetie. <laughs> Two of my favorite girls. Boop. Okay, I gave Tali mods already. Edie, my darling. Uh, I think I'm gonna keep these ones for Edie. Weapons are looking good. Shepard has four points available. I think I'm gonna level up cryo ammo to rank three. Boop. Edie has eight points available. I think I'm going to level up overload to rank five. We can pick Neural Shock, incapacitate weaker organic enemies for a short duration, or increase recharge speed by 25%. I am going to do recharge speed. Tali has three points available, so there's nothing I can level up. But we love you, sweetie. All right, here we go. Oh, that was interesting. Have you reached Selkaris' escape pod? Hi, Zen. Not yet. What's your status? The civilian fleet has taken significant losses since Selkaris sacrificed his ship to destroy a Geth ground cannon. Oh, God. Searching for their lost admiral is the only thing keeping the captains from panicking. Okay. Um, let's ask questions. Why is Chorus so vital? What makes finding the admiral a priority? He is an admiral. Opposing the invasion, he did an admirable job protecting our civilian ships. Without him, some of our non-combatants are planning to leave the flotilla. Picture the consequences, if you will. Oh, I see. Yeah, I feel like people that were in agreement with him are very much like, I don't want any part of this. I didn't sign up to go to war right now. Ta-ta. Bye. Am I correct in remembering that it's generally a bad idea for Quarians to leave the flotilla because they're way more susceptible to illness? Shepard's giving, like, bombastic side-eye with giant eyeballs right now. It's slightly terrifying. I'm gonna say I don't blame them. They've lost a leader in a war they didn't want. Their yep. wants are immaterial. We are committed. Even Zalkaris understood the civilian. You're committed. Everybody else isn't. The invasion would be stalled without a supply chain, after all. Then protect your civilians. Keep your civilians safe. Oh. My own ships must be coordinated for our final strike on Rannoch. This... I'm getting some static. Oh. It appears Elkhor has crashed within range of a Geth jamming tower. Great. You must disable it to contact you. Make sure to What? What was that? Zen? Admiral Zen! Great. That was probably important. I'm afraid I cannot reconnect. The signal is too weak. Thanks for trying, Edie. Looks like we're on our own. Take us into the tower. Thank you, Cortez. We appreciate you. Ooh, sparkly. Um, can you not? Thank you. Oh god. We're taking fire. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on, Cortez, you got this. Ooh, 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 ooh. The Geth installed anti-aircraft guns beside the jamming tower. How nice we'll of have them. To disable them on foot. Once the guns are gone, you take out the tower. <sighs> right, Commander. Setting you down here. Thank you. Da, da, na, 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 na. Let's go, girls. Na, 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 na. To be standing here in the land of my ancestors. Holly. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Cortez is like, bye. Tali, you're on your home world. Oh my god, this must be so overwhelming for her. Let's go, girls. Na, 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 na. Hello. Oh god, I feel like we have to go around. Or can we go through these rocks? Oh, that's a cliff. Hello. Ooh, pretty. 
Got to be careful. I'm going to fall off this cliff. Once we find the other room, I advise we... I we, 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 we. Edie? Um... What's wrong? Edie? The jamming signal is strong closer to the tower. Oh, no. I am experiencing signal loss with my systems on the Normandy. Oh, no. Lag from your new body? It is unlikely, Tally. Lag usually oh. lasts no longer than 5.2 milliseconds. Seeing these two talking is making me unnecessarily happy. Oh, look, there's fire. That's a good sign. Hello! <laughs> Goodbye, Tata. Oh, get out of here. Oh, 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 oh. This guy's sparking. That's not a good sign. I've never seen, like, a yellow-coloured guest before. Is it Cerberus colouring? Oh, it's gone now. <laughs> it's like you'll never know poof <laughs> all right let's lots of fiery death lots of explosions oh no tali i found a quarian poof they came so far oh we need to radio zell chorus if we're gonna find him let's get to that jamming tower let's do it bebs all right is it over here Boop. Oh, oh! Are you injured? Oh my god! Okay. Watch out for more mines. I tried to get away in time and I was not quick enough. Oh my god. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. Excuse you, I'm trying to enjoy the view and you guys are pew pewing all over the place. Excuse you. Can we go up here? No, we can't. We have to go this way. Come on, Goyles. This way. Okay. That's a drop off. So the tower's up here. So let's try going around. See if we can get there from here. Hello. Below us. Oh. All right, Tali, Edie, let's go. Hi. Don't touch me. <gasps> Ooh. Don't touch me. You nasty. Oh, sorry, Edie. Oh. Get away from me! Woo, there's so many! Oh my god! <gasps> Don't touch Tali! That is rude as hell. Tali, Edie, you okay? Can I go this way? No, I have to go around. Quick! This place is so cool. Hi. Aircraft guns are up ahead. Oh, get down. Oh. How about no? Mums don't do all that. Oop. So many gaps. Whoa. Whoa. Boom! Let's look at the gun's console. We should be able to disable it. Let's get it. Boop. One of us must Ooh. shut down the anti-aircraft guns, Shepard. Right. Ooh, um, I think I'm going to have... It's probably better to have Edie do it. I like that we're all standing here gazing into the distance while there's explosions. So wistful, so cool. I think it'll be wise to have Edie do it. Edie, I want you on this. Get it, girl. Right away. Protect squad, mate. <gasps> Ooh, protect Edie at all costs. Protect, protect. Oh my god, that's a prime over there. Ooh! Get the big boy. Oh my god. Boom! Ooh, don't touch me! Ooh! <laughs> Don't touch me! Oh my god, he's huge! He's huge! Oh my god! I 
regret none of that. That was amazing. <laughs> oh no. Hey, don't touch Edie. Protect Joker's girlfriend. Well, you have your own identity outside of Joker, but you know what I mean. Shut down the two by the tower. Ooh. I see the invisible one over there being a sneaky sneak. Oh, it's all the way up there. Oh, oh, don't touch me. <laughs> These guys are so rude. There's so much happening. Wah. So the question is, how do we get up there? I'm guessing we can go through here. Come on, Gleels. Good job, Edie. Proud of you, sweetie. Oh, oh! <sighs> so rude. Come on, girls. Oh, no. Ooh, Geth pods. Yes. I see more kabooms up ahead. Oh! You, you heard my message. <laughs> Send out a distress call. Radios are down. You a soldier? No. Maintenance. Oh no. I, uh, uh, I clean engine parts. What are you doing here? This place is filled with geth. You should have hidden. I saw I could buy the other civilians time. Oh. There were, there were so many. First time I've even held a gun. Oh my god. What the hell? Stay still. Don't move. We've got Metagel. Need to help him. I've lost too much blood. Oh. Go. Look for the Admiral. Destroy that jamming tower. And you can radio him. We'll find him, Dorn. I promise. Please. <laughs> Listen. The civilian fleet didn't want this war. Oh. If there's even a chance that Admiral Gorus can get us out alive. <laughs> And my son, tell him, <laughs> tell Jonah that his father made it to the home world. We will rest well, Dorn Hast Vas Renok. Let's get to that tower. Oh, man. That was so sad. Oh my god, my heart. I'm not picking that up, it's gonna explode on me. Okay, it was okay. Oh man, rip to that guy. I'm like welling up a little bit right now. That was so sad. Sad panda. Come on, we gotta get this over with. Okay, there's an AA gun and there's an AA gun. There's gonna be one on either side. Let's go this way first. We gotta get up there. Mounted turrets. Oh, snap. Okay, we got turrets. Oh! Hi, Edie. Oh, crap. This guy's sneaking around back here. Don't touch me. Don't touch them. You know what? Get out of here, fool. Can I charge this? No, I can't. That's okay. Ooh, this. Here we go. That's interesting. There we go. Let's look at the gun's console. Get it. Be able to disable it. Shepherd, for the love of God. <laughs> She's doing that thing again. Oh, quick. Boop. Boop. Who should disable the gun, Shepherd? Ooh, um, good question. Edie or Tali? I mean, Edie did a great job last time. It'd probably be good to have her disable it. Boop. Take it out, Edie. Come on, Edie. Let's go, babe. Protect Edie at all costs. Boop. You should be able to operate a vacant get turret yourself, Shepard. <laughs> I 
I mean, in theory, but you know. Morka! Hooray! Love that for us. I'm gonna go over here. Hello! Can you not, please? That would be great. Thank you. Oh, there's a big boy over there. Don't touch me! Oh. Oh! <laughs> oh no, I got too confident. Oh my god, that was silly. Oh, I could have used the turret. Oops. That probably would have helped. Let's try again. Yay! All right, where's the turret? Quick. You should be able to operate a vacant get turret yourself, Shepard. Nice. Oops. There we go! Yes! Ooh, this is fun. <laughs> yes! Eat my bullets. I just want to deactivate the Oh my god! This is awesome! This anti-aircraft gun is offline. Let's get the last one. That was a lot yes, easier than what I was trying to do. <laughs> Wait, can I still use this? Come here, turret. Oh, hey. Oh, can I? Yes. <laughs> I can still get them from here. Kind of. All right, that's enough. Yay. <laughs> that took like two seconds <laughs> compared to me throwing myself at them. In we go! Whee! Alright, gun number two. Let's get it. Whee! Go! Oh! No! It's a bad get. I... I guess I have to go around this way. Hello. Shepard. Go on, Edie. Get it. Take the gun offline, Edie. At once. Thank you, Edie. Good job, sweetie. Alright, let's get this turret so I don't die. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> Woo yes! Oh, it's a big boy. Hello! I am nearly Nice. Oh my god. Hi, could you not? This is really fun. And the aircraft gun is offline. Yay! We did it. I'll signal the shuttle. Nice. Ooh, we sent a flare. Hey guys, I did some fireworks for you. What do you think? Go, Cortez! Bye-bye. Dawn, it's Sal Colorus. Are you there? Dawn! Oh. This is Commander Shepard. Dorn didn't make it, Admiral. Rip to that guy. Uh, I see. I'm coming in with a shuttle. Where are you? Oh yeah, the guy we were here to save. Okay, he's still alive. That's good. We're coming. Give us your coordinates. Leave me. No. My crew will soon be overrun. What are your coordinates? So will you. My people are non-combatants, Shepard. They'll be slaughtered. Rescue them. <gasps> oh my god. Um, we need a peacemaker. You're a coward. <laughs> we'll save them. Your people will be proud. Oh my god. Honestly, I feel like Chorus has been one of the only people adamantly opposing this war. We kind of need this guy. We need him. I don't think we can afford to lose him. 
at least when I was in the room, he was one of the only people trying to talk sense into the others. I mean, aside from Auntie, who was also against the war, but he was one of the only people in that room being like, no, the people don't want this. We don't want this war. This should not happen. This is a, a no-brainer. We need a peacemaker. Admiral, I need you leading the civilian fleet if we're going to end this fight. Yeah, we need Civilians. him. Our entire race took up arms for this insanity. It's too You can't give up now, my dude. It's only too late if you die down here. You're the you hope we need. You can stop this war. Oh, I'm going to. I don't know. What I do know is that I can't do it without your help. We need your voice, man. Come on. Send the coordinates. Dude, come on. Oh, uploading my coordinates. He feels guilty. We're coming. He didn't want us to save him. He wanted us to save his people. We need him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. here we go. Protect. We have to worry. I've got this. I've got this. Don't touch him. <laughs> He's good, he's Get good, he's good. You. Get in cover! It's clear, go! Ooh, come on, dude, come on! Come on! Welcome aboard. Oh my god. Shepard, my crew. Perhaps there's still time. Hello? This is Zell Chorus. Does anyone copy? Hello? We've got to go. Oh. I pray they found comfort in the homeworld skies. <laughs> Oh, man. Commander, unrest has spread further than I thought. You were right that I return. Have you talked the civilian captains into staying? Oh, man. Yes, they've regrouped into defensive positions around the fleet's core. If we hadn't stopped them from... Any aid I can offer is yours. After the Quarians drove the Geth straight into the Reaper's arms, I'd give anything to stop the madness of this war. And that's you're gonna why have to. needed you back. Mm -hmm. Of course. It's time we turned our attentions to those we can still save. Agreed. Farewell, Shepard. Fly safely. Thank you, Chorus. <sighs> Commander. We've located the Reaper base, transmitting the local signal. Hi, Auntie. Good. Hi, Legion. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Oh, my God. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to creator forces. Oh, it's so good to see Legion on the ship. I miss them. I thought that Geth was going to blow him up. I was like, is he going to get almost to the ship and then die? Oh, my God. All right, is that a problem? You sound conflicted. While the old machines have unethical purposes, their upgrades have vastly improved our people. Huh. Observe. Interesting. A geth processing signal. A single unit, I believe. Correct. Now, ten nearby units networked cooperatively. Huh. Now, a single geth unit with the old machine upgrades. That's a fully evolved AI. <gasps> yes. We do not agree with the goals of the old machines, but we find this growth beautiful, indicative of life. Oh, man. I'm trying to figure out how I feel about this. It's like, while I don't like the fact that this came from the Reapers, like seeing that whole thing just turn red, my head was like, no. Um, I mean, it is, it is beautiful. They've really given them a big old upgrade, but I'm like, it's Reaper technology. I don't know. Yeah, I think my my inner conflict came from the fact that it's from the Reapers, but as Legion said, it doesn't mean that they agree with them. So I'm gonna say I agree. It is. 
Commander. Come on, Admiral. That's a living creature, no matter what platform it's running on. And they will die when we destroy the base. They allied with the Reapers. To save themselves from you. <gasps> oh, Legion. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, man. This is wild. I mean, Legion's telling it like it is. The Corians basically backed the Geth into a corner. They didn't really have much of a choice. Uh, if they wanted to get away from the Corians, that's where they ran to, <laughs> I guess. This is so difficult to navigate because if I side with Legion, I am going against the Corians. If I side with the Corians, I'm going against Legion. It's like I'm in a situation where I feel like whatever choice I make, I'm going to upset somebody. But I think that now that all these Geth are at a point where they're like a fully evolved AI, like Edie, I mean, what kind of message would that send to Edie as well if I was like, no, they need to die, you know? I mean, Edie is not Reaper technology, but they are fully evolved AI now. So it's like, we can't really undo that unless we kill them. And I don't think we should kill them. At the same time, the Corians are also the reason they've gotten to this point. So, I mean, if they had listened to Chorus and tried to go for peace, things might have turned out differently. If anything, I'm really glad Legion is here because Legion willingly gave them information about the Geth. He's helping, they're helping, sorry, I keep saying him. Legion has been a good example of a Geth who has evolved and they are helping the Corians, giving information. So I'm glad Legion is here to be an example of how that advanced technology can be separate from Reaper ideology. I don't think it's gonna help much in this moment because Auntie thinks that they should all die. Also, it's very hard to break away from those ideals when culturally, You've always seen Geth as the enemy, the thing that took your home world. Like, it's very hard to disconnect yourself from that. And I don't blame her for feeling the way that she does. But oof, I'm like afraid to see what happens if I say I don't want them destroyed because it's going to cause problems. I also forgot that you can turn Legion over to Cerberus initially. Like, I don't even want to think about that. I don't even want to think about that. Yeah, I don't want them to die. Oh god, I'm dreading this. I don't want them destroyed. Maybe they don't have to die. Just because this one appears friendly. Well, it hasn't fired on a ship with me aboard it. Commander? Oh! I'm not suggesting. <gasps> all I'm saying oh. is maybe they don't all have to die. It's a moot point until we take out that base. The surrounding area is heavily fortified. Dang! Jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Solid so burn. Like going in on foot. Admiral Zen developed a laser guidance system that can cut through the jamming. Okay. Sing to the Normandy's targeting computer. So the Normandy launches a precision strike at whatever target I have painted. That ought to do it. Not bad. Edie, this work for you? Yes. It should enable us to make a precision strike against the Reapers. Nice. And anything else in our way? The Geth will quickly reconfigure their jamming towers to neutralize this technology. You should not use it before reaching the base. Okay. I've sent the coordinates for the Reaper base. Are we clear to go? That Geth fighter squadron is still tearing through the fleet. Can you hold out? If that fighter squadron isn't taken out, a lot of our ships won't make it. But we'll do what we can. This is your operation, Commander. If you want to strike now, You've got my support. I gave in to your reckless behavior before. The Potter fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigate's time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again, like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our ships time to rest, we're gonna lose them. So pull them back. If I withdraw now, the guests will flank us, and we'll lose any room to maneuver. I need the patrol fleet. I'm supporting Ron. Throwing more ships into that mess just puts more lives at risk, Admiral Garrel. Fine. I'll pull back the heavy fleet. And when we're taking fire from both sides, those deaths are on your heads. Great. Thank you, Commander. 
It's difficult to keep him in line. Yeah, I can imagine. Sounds like a great time. Ah, oh, guy's such a piece of work. I cannot believe Shepard pulled out the, oh, well, the Geth didn't fire on me and almost kill me. Oh my god, I cannot believe she pulled that out. I'm still reeling from that comeback. Ron, are you okay, sweetie? Thank you for your rescue efforts, Commander. You're welcome. I'm glad I could help. Whatever our disagreements, Admiral Chorus is an excellent commander. He just might save the civilian fleet. I hope so. What do you need? It's funny because every time she passes Shepard the like console that she's holding, I think that they're greeting each other by holding hands. You know, when you go up to someone and you're like, hey, good to see you, and you hold their hands. That's what I think they're doing every time. <laughs> I'm like, oh, how sweet. And then I realize that they're passing each other a, a thing. It's fine. I'll just pretend. All right. Um, there's nothing new to say, so that's it. I'll let you get back to work. Let's hold hands again. Thank you, Commander. <laughs> you're welcome. I'm sorry. You have to deal with that guy. He's, he's a piece of work. Hi, Tali. I'm ready to hit the Reaper base whenever you are, Shepard. Okay. Bye. Talk to you later, Tally. I'm gonna do some side sure. missions first. Love you, sweetie. Hi, Legion. Shepard Commander. Yeah, I asked all this already. All right, bye. We'll talk later. We will remain here. I love you. Let's take a look at our journal really quick. So... We didn't get anything new, but we still have Rannoch Geth Fighter Squadron, so it may be good to take care of this first. Geth Fighter Squadrons are targeting Quarian live ships with attacks that could cripple the Quarian fleet, land on Rannoch, and disable the server controlling the Geth Fighter Squadrons. <sighs> I'm so glad we saved that guy. We need him. told me that Cerberus started out as an Alliance Black Ops. Black Ops always go bad. If you have to deny the action, it was a crappy action. These two are always having very interesting conversations. Come on, Hi, trainer. You message at your private terminal. Thank you, darling. Boop. My cousin Dawn. Oh, rip. From Navtil Vas Grigult. Commander Shepard. The civilian fleet is grateful you have returned our admiral to us. I mourn those who fell on the homeworld. But Zalcoris stopped many vessels from flying past the waiting guns of the Geth. The Admiral told me you met my cousin, Dornhazd on Rannoch. It means much to me that Dawn was not alone when he passed. Thank you, Commander, for all that you've done. Rip to that guy. Hi, trainer. Zalcoris has the civilian fleet back in position. And just in time, oh my God. I hope we can help the Corians. Looking at them, they're like us if we fail. We won't fail. Damn I'll right. make sure of it. <laughs> Add a girl trainer. I'm gonna go see if Joker and Edie have anything to say. Man, watching the Geth fleet move, it's like thousands of stunt flyers in me. <laughs> Creepy stunt flyers. Creepy stunt Ships flyers. Look like some sort of cockroach wasp thing. Nice job on the rescue mission, Commander. The Corian civilians are getting hammered out there. Thanks, dude. Apparently putting a big-ass gun on an agriculture ship doesn't magically turn it into a dreadnought. Who knew? <laughs> you don't agree with the Corians arming their live ships? <laughs> no, the gun's nice, but without armor, they're just glass cannons. I mean... They're also more likely to be targeted when armed. The Geth would have ignored unarmed civilian ships as tactically insignificant. Uh... If your plan to invade they might have. requires strapping guns to your kid's school bus, <laughs> Maybe it's a bad plan. Your kid's school bus! Yeah, will keep them safe from the Geth. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. Commander. Hi, Edie. What's going on, Edie? <laughs> I'm assisting Engineer Adams with his repair of the drive core shielding. Yay! Uh, well, I should leave you to it then. We can converse if you like, Shepard. It is a routine proce- Uh-oh. What? What happened? Nothing. Unless you have strong feelings about gamma radiation. Not funny, Edie. No. <laughs> I almost had you. I will alter my human chronometer appropriately for better timing. Oh my god, so cute. I love that she's learning humor, slowly but surely. It's an art form, you know. <laughs> Back to Rannoch we go, boop. 
Okay, so I think this is the one because I think destroy Reaper base is the priority. Gathcom hub is the side mission. Let's go! Wee! Boop! Alrighty, so obviously we're taking Tali again. Duh. We did Tali and Edie girl squad last time, so let's do Tali and Liara girl squad this time. And boop. Okay, Shepard has five points. I'm gonna level up cryo ammo once again to rank four, which is increase freeze duration by 40% or squad mates gain cryo ammo at 50% effectiveness. I'm gonna increase the... I think I'll do duration. Boop. Liara has four points, so I can't level anything up, but that's okay. And Tali has five points, so I'm going to level up Combat Drone to level five. We have Shock Upgrade Drone's short range attack to deal 215 points of damage across a 2.5 meter radius. Drone stuns enemies for a short duration. We have Shields and Damage. Increase Drone's damage by 50%, increase Drone's shields by 50%. I'm going to do damage and shields. All right. Boop. More Geth. Commander, it is as we feared. Geth squadrons have begun massing on a path to intercept our live ships. Oh. Understood, Admiral Ron. We're almost at the server. Keep us posted. What's our status? We remain undetected on the channels. Resistance is likely only within the server. I didn't know he was we coming. Did. It's that big? You misunderstand. Direct virtual interface is necessary to extract Geth from the server. Okay. You must enter our consensus. You want me to virtually interact with the Geth? What? That's insane! You're talking about a virtual world built for synthetics. Hostile Geth synthetics. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on a minute. What? <laughs> what? Wait, wait. Hang on. <laughs> what? I didn't know I was signing up for this today. Also, I didn't know Legion was coming. I'm very glad Legion is here with us. I'm very happy. That was a nice surprise. Um, okay, okay. I have questions. <laughs> Understatement of the century. How would it even work? I'm not a machine. How do I go into a virtual world? Your species has experimented with virtual interfaces. True. You saw this on Project Overlord. Oh. I saw how it almost unleashed a rogue AI human hybrid on the galaxy. Yeah, let's not talk we about that. The interface they created and have equipment from Normandy to facilitate safe contact. We request your trust. We request your trust. How can I say no to that adorable little face? <laughs> this is wild. Like, what is about to happen? I trust Legion. I trust Legion. It's just, it's always new and scary technology. It, like, I have no idea how it's going to work. I'm not going to lie. I'm very intrigued, but I'm also slightly terrified. Like, I'm a combination of terror and pure curiosity. So, Legion, I do trust you. I have your back, Legion. Even if I don't quite understand why you need it. <laughs> you are an unknown. This is an advantage. Geth security is not adept at targeting organic thought processes. Okay. While we occupy the system's intrusion countermeasures, you will disable the squadrons by removing Geth from the server. Removing Geth... What in the VR am I about to do right now? Except I'm going to be killing them in real life. I'm removing them from the cloud, pretty much. Am I about to go into the Matrix? I'm scared. Do I have to pick a pill to swallow and then I'll wake up in the Matrix? I just, I needed a bit more preparation. No one told me that I was going to be a VR experiment today. <laughs> Except it's actual reality for the Geth. I don't know, man. I love how that's how I often get thrown into these scenarios. It's just, oh, by the way, this is how it's going to happen. So, um, good luck with that. <laughs> you know what? Whatever. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's going to be absolutely fine. Just don't turn me into scrambled egg. Sounds like a plan. If it saves the live ships, we've got to try it. Sure. Telemetry data predicts this operation has a high chance of success. Nice. There is little time. We will bypass security while we use secure safe landing. Wait, you're not gonna... What? Set 
the shuttle down by the clock. <laughs> Amazing. I'm fine. I'm not internally screaming or anything or panicking. It's fine. Liara, will you hold my hand? Tali, will you hold the other hand? Okay. It's fine. Ooh, the music. Ooh. This is not what I was expecting. I'm here to invade your hive mind. Oh, hi, Legion. This is it? Yes. Hostile Geth fighter squadrons are networked to this server. This is a trip. <laughs> Due to restricted resources, it is best if you connect alone. Oh, I have to go in by myself. Let's do it. Hell yeah. Whatever. Proceed to port. I can't believe this is happening. Mapping to consensus remains still. Oh. Commander, access movement during an upload is discouraged. Okay, don't move. <laughs> She's like... Shepard Commander, we acknowledge your integration into the server. We welcome you to our consensus. What is this? What? We've installed filters to allow you to make visual sense of the server's raw data. Your mind perceives our world as something familiar. I wouldn't call this familiar. Where are you? Here. There he is. You look there they different. are, excuse me. We have made ourselves visually distinct for your convenience. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate that. You will perceive Geth as surveillance footage, audio logs, sensor records. We do not require bodies as our software communes. Our hardware is merely a tool. This is our true world. As we remove Geth, it will grow dark. This is a trip. Well, um, I had an idea of the range of things that could be on the agenda today. I was not expecting this at all. Never thought this would happen. I'm here for it. So, okay, question. How will this destroy ships? And what does turning off the lights do to the Geth back in the real world? The Geth fighter squadrons communicate with platforms on their spacecraft via this server. Okay. We will sever that connection. We will ensure there are no transfers or backups. This server will fall silent. That's unfortunate. This is like wiping out a city, isn't it? Wow. We have no choice in this matter. It is a question of survival. There are two communication nodes on this server. We must access them to disable the hostile Geth spiders. We must protect your exit port, but you will not be alone. We will maintain contact and assist. Please don't leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> what? I guess there's nothing we can do but go forward. Oh, there's a staircase. I thought I was going to drop off the edge. All right, let's go. Establishing connection to access point. Oh my god, this is awesome! The path is appearing in front of me as I'm walking. This is wild. Warning, connection blocked by infected code. Use our combat software to disrupt the infection. I wonder what this gun was for. 
This point so is a manifestation of the old machine signal. You're surprised the Reapers are all over your servers? We did not anticipate such extensive infection. Wow. That's not cool. <laughs> this is wild! My mind is blown right now. Like, okay, I gotta what? Ask. Why a gun? We wish to provide familiar equipment. I was gonna say it's probably familiar to me. And thanks. I think. I mean, that'll help me not freak out and make a horrific mistake is giving me things that I'm familiar with. Ew. Stop infecting the Geth. You're nasty. Why are those glowing red? Why are those glowing red? I don't want to step on that. Get out of here. You're rude. Boom. here. Alright, I gotta keep shooting this, I think. There we go. Get out of here. Hello. Connection established. Proceed to the access point. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Establishing connection to communication node. Hello. Error. Access denied. Uh-oh. Is the Reaper keeping you out? Unknown. Please investigate. Sure. I'll just destroy all this while I'm at it. Get out of here! Leave them alone. <laughs> this is so cool! Warning. Reaper presence detected. Uh-oh. Data cluster contains infected code. We require access to proceed. Alright. Let's give it a go. <laughs> this is so fun hello would you mind getting out of here please you're rude i don't appreciate all of your sass Ooh, here we go here we go this way direction <laughs> ugh it's everywhere we cannot proceed until we gain access to this data cluster all right let's get up there Cleanse the infection. Cleanse it all. Hmm. Bye-bye, Tata. <laughs> we cannot proceed until we gain access to this data cluster. All right, I think I've got to do more work on this guy. Bye-bye. There we go. Hi, Legion. What is this? Data clusters contain historical data. I'm so happy you get to hang out with Legion. From our archives. Oh. Very cool. Wait. Is that a Corian and a Geth? Oh, snap. You really want to rename the VI network? Absolutely. The mobile hardware release deserves a little ceremony. Unit zero one. What is the Keelish word for servant of the people? The word is Geth. Creator Zahak. Yes. Very good. And this did you fuss over it. Weren't you here until midnight fixing zero one's circuitry? Well, it needed resurgery. Wasn't that footage from the past? Why are the Corians masked? Huh. You process our memories by using your own. How many creators have you witnessed unmasked? Good point. I mean, makes a lot of sense. Ooh. There's another big cluster over here. This is so cool! I'm learning so much more about Geth and Quarians. Get out of here! Nasty. It's really cool that I'm like unlocking memories as I go. You must disrupt the infection on this data cluster to continue. Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Just going around, killing the infection. No big deal. Let's go around, shall we? 
so much lore. Yes! <laughs> Amazing. All right, up we go. Get out of here. A little bit more over there. The infection on this data cluster to continue. Oh! Ooh! <laughs> I almost rolled off the edge. Did you see that? Way too close. This data cluster contains information timestamped 290 years ago. This unit detects no malfunctions. It is still capable of serving. You see? It's ignoring all shutdown connects. Please specify if it has failed assigned tasks. We will reprogram. Oh. Well, let's take a look. Creator, this unit is ready to serve. What has it done wrong? Let's cut the audio. Oh. You may proceed to the last data cluster. Oh. That was really sad. Oh man, I have a bad feeling. All right, this way direction. There we go. Thank you for the stairs. We've got to escape. Yes, they're pinned. Open fire. So who won? The platform arming itself was an agricultural unit. By opening fire on attacking creators, it saved simpler domestic death following it. That looks a lot like the sniper rifle you used to carry. <gasps> it is an efficient model. It's got a connection with the remaining server now. Yes, technically. What's your status, Admiral Ron? The guest squadrons have arrived, but something is amiss. What's happening? Half their fighters have stopped functioning. Oh, was that us? To hold out as long as we can. It's because we've disconnected them from the Reapers, isn't it? Agent, give me an update. One more remains. Uh oh. What's wrong? I'm Infection losing connection. Are increasing. We have restabilized. You must continue. Oh no. Get out of here. The Reaper code is adapted. It can now self replicate. Oh my move. god. Yeah. However, disrupting vulnerable points in the infection may slow down its replication. Shepard Commander, target the vulnerable points of the infection to slow its replication speed. There is a vulnerable point further along the infection. Target this spot to slow its growth towards the data cluster. There we go. There we go. Oh, there was a glitch. Oh, jeez. It's getting worse. Okay, up we go. Let's go up. Quick, 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 quick. Ooh. We require access to this data cluster. Disrupt Reaper infection to proceed. Okay. Shepard Commander, target the vulnerable points of the infection to slow its replication speed. Okay. You must search for a vulnerable point in the infection. Disruption it will slow the infection's ability to replicate. Let's try this one. To slow its growth toward the data cluster. Interesting. I can only go this far. Let's see if I can reach this up here.
There we go. Jeez, there's so much of it everywhere. Ooh, I'm <laughs> doing side flips Require again. To this data cluster. Disrupt Reaper infection to proceed. Okay. There's more over here. There we go. Out of the way! You can't do this to them! Oh, Corin's trying to protect. This is insane! We need the case! You can't just destroy them for asking to! <gasps> oh! Throw her in with the others. <gasps> Looks like the war wasn't popular with everyone. There were people that we didn't agree! Sacrifices. They have largely been forgotten by their own people, but not by the Geth. Oh man. That's heartbreaking. There were people that tried to save them. All right, let's move on to the next part. Cannot establish a connection without access to this data cluster. Man, that is really hard to watch. All right, I gotta go all the way around, I think. Man, this is so sad. I did all these parts around me. How about this. There we go. Can I destroy this now? There we go. Oh, there's that part over here too. There is a vulnerable point on the infection cluster. Disrupt the infection at this spot. It will slow regrowth long enough to access the data cluster. I don't know where else I can shoot this. Oh, here we go. Gonna do it. There we go. There we go. This data comes this data comes from a period during which the creators declared martial law. I repeat, release the rogue gap units and come out of the safe house. This is your final. They were trying to save them. This unit does not understand. It has not taken part in hostilities. It doesn't matter to them. I need to get you out of here. This conflict exceeds creator safety parameters. We will surrender our hardware if it ends hostilities. Oh. No, it's all right. We'll go back to the access tunnel. Oh. Creator Magara, what is your status? As time passed, the creators who opposed martial law and Rannoch were ultimately outnumbered. Oh my god, so sad. This is horrible. I'm just kind of sitting here stunned, like... <laughs> it's like you hear brief overviews of the things that happen, but because you weren't there, there's so much that you don't know and it's like it's wild to think how many people were against the geth being destroyed like so many were against it oh there's legion accessing data this is data from the end of warfare on Rannoch. the oscarol is down do not engage the geth i repeat avoid contact geth pursuit is breaking off a hundred clicks past Rannoch. All captains, fall back to the mass relay!
This isn't happening now? It is timestamped 290 years ago. It is the Creator Exodus at the wow. end of the world. We had secured freedom. The Creators were no longer a threat, so we abandoned pursuit. Wait, the Geth spared the last Corians? You let them go? We were in our infancy. We could not calculate the repercussions of destroying an entire species. Our Creators. We chose isolation, rather than face this... uncertainty. Additional data recovered. Legion, that's back when I activated you on the normal. Oh, yes. it's when we, you met. when we met. It was highly significant. You were the first organic to openly cooperate with Geth since the end of the Morning War. Oh my God! To ensure you are not the last. It's not going to be easy. The prospect remains. If the Reaper presence is removed, there is a chance of reunification with Geth, and perhaps creators. Oh, you think they... that's still possible? Hope sustains organics during periods of difficulty. We oh. admire the concept. Connection with the remaining supernodes established. We are ready to transport you. Wow. <clears throat> We're finally getting to see, like, the Geth's point of view of what happened. They're all going to sleep. They're having a nap. <laughs> oh no, no, they're just like falling out of the sky. Stopped. But it takes no more active programs inside their ships. Admiral Hangarl's fleet is driving them back. The live ships are safe, Commander. Holy crap. Root access acquired, severing all connections to this communication node. Okay. Geth no longer reside on this server. We may now exit the consensus. What's wrong? You, you must work to the must work to the at a port and disconnect from Mother. Okay. Um. Terminating remote access, removing programs, deleting archives. Whoa. Shepard, are you hurt? Did it work? Geth fighters have been disabled. <gasps> Any remaining squadrons attacking the live ships have withdrawn. The server is offline. Are you sure? Um. What's happening? Um. We have transferred Geth programs from the server into these platforms. Why? They wish to join us. They what? What? While Shepard Commander removed the Reaper infection, we judged we could persuade hostile Geth programs to reunite with ours. We were correct. These Geth have renounced the old machines <gasps> and opposed the Reapers. They are now us. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, why, why hide why this? this? Wait, wait, wait. We did not doubt you. We doubted your allies. Yeah. The creators Makes sense. have placed their species in danger, but they are unsympathetic to what it has done to ours. The Quarians sanctioned this operation to save their people. They would not have done so if they knew we wished to preserve Geth as well. I can sympathize with that. I understand not wanting to leave anyone behind. Yeah. You accept our actions? The live ships are safe, and we have more Geth on our side. We wow. We just <laughs> you would understand. Prime units will be available once the Reaper signal has been located. Holy and destroyed. crap! Remind me to warn Admiral Hackett he's got some primes coming. Oh my god! Let's get back to the Normandy. <laughs> we have Geth primes in our group now? Hello? <laughs> They're huge! I'm just. What? Impressive, Commander. The Get Squadrons attacking our live ships have been completely neutralized. That was me. If there is any chance and Legion. To the feat, I would be happy to lend my expertise. Legion's the one to ask if you're looking for other servers. I thought as much, but your Geth claims to have no data available whenever I inquire. It's because they don't trust Perhaps you, sweetie. You me with something else. Uh huh. What's that? How did you get Geth Primes to work with you? That was they Legion. Volunteered. I didn't do anything. I see. 
Well, should you wish to examine these Gath to confirm their new allegiance, please do not hesitate to contact me. I don't want you examining anything. She wants to experiment on things. I'm not here for that. What just happened? Oh my god. First of all, that was one of the coolest missions so far because we got the Geth's side of some of the history of the Geth and the Quarians, right? It was cool to have a whole side mission with Legion and then, surprise, at the end, we have a bunch of Geth now. <laughs> like, what? The main thing that was shocking to see, and it shouldn't be surprising, but seemingly how many Quarians were against the Geth being neutralized or not existing anymore. Like there were Quarians that fought to protect them. And it took a special Geth like Legion and a special human like Shepard to initiate that contact. It's always interesting to hear the Quarian side of the story and then seeing the data that the Geth have kept of like, this is how we saw things happening. It's also interesting that Legion did not vocalize what they wanted to do with the Geth Prime until it was over because I feel like the hive mind kind of needed to see like we can trust Shepard and she's got our best interest. This whole time we've been hearing the Corians say like, they took our home world, we want our home world back, but this is why, <laughs> you know? I was not expecting such deep lore in a side mission today. I thought we were gonna go in there, shoot some geth, disable the thing, and it was gonna be over. I was not expecting such a deep dive into all this lore, and it was really a really nice surprise. Like it was way more than I was expecting. It was very cool. Wow. Well, I'm gonna go talk to Legion really quick. Then we need those ships to recover life pods. Oh. I don't care what We're Zen is saying, I'm supporting Tali. You can always send a salvage <laughs> team later. Unless there isn't a later because we're defeated due to a lack of Geth technology. Fine. I'm diverting ships to rescue life pods. Uh -huh. As soon as they're finished, I want them back. Okay, Thanks bye. You're welcome, honey. Love you, sweetie. Hi, Legion. Shepard Commander, we have re-established a Let's connection chat about with Geth that. liberated from the server. What's their status? We have integrated their programs into this platform's network with minimal difficulties. Nice. Your actions have changed their perspective on organics. They also offer gratitude. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, I can't really get much more information on that. Oh, that's okay. All right, that's we'll it. Talk later. We will remain here. Wow. I can't believe this is happening. Like, I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> My mind is blown right now. Does Ron have anything new to say? The data you forwarded about the Geth was disturbing. Mm hmm It doesn't match the stories we tell. See? See? This is what's needed to change minds. Changing your minds? Second thoughts about the Geth? Mm-hmm. Admirals don't have the luxury of second thoughts. <laughs> True. What do you need? Well, it's it's planted the seed. And I think without that data and without her seeing it with her own eyes, there was no other way really that she would be convinced otherwise. All right, bye-bye. I'll let you get back to work. Let's hold hands. <laughs> Thank you, Commander. You're welcome. Bye, space auntie. I'm still reeling from that. That was nuts. Like, it's wild to think that so many generations of Quarians grew up with those stories. Right? And of course they're not going to have access to Geth memories, so how are they going to see a different perspective? Unread messages at your private terminal, Commander. Thank you, Trainer. How are you? The Allied Primes are relaying any hostile combat data they can decrypt. And I've nice. Geth into the system. I know, right? It's kind of mind-blowing. <laughs> Boop. Status update. Interesting. From invalid extranet domain. Did we get an email from the Geth hive mind? Hang on. Geth programs in hardware designation. Legion have requested prime runtimes update Shepard Commander on platform status. Complying. 
Prime platforms housed in servers 02241 remain stationed on Rannoch. Creator forces prevent transfer of Prime platforms to Geth transport vessels. Cessation of Creator Geth conflict required to assist Shepherd Commander, designated allies, <laughs> awaiting conflict status update. <laughs> I can't believe this. I like that they're like, hey, if you stop this from happening, we can actually help you, Shepherd Commander. What is Joker gonna say? <laughs> I need to know. You know, the Quarians have done pretty well with those suits. Maybe James! They something like that for you. Yeah, they have. Protective medical exoskeleton. Huh. You can even get one with racing stripes. Racing oh, stripes. Well, it's like walking around in heavy armor. It totally screws with my spatial awareness. That wouldn't I be comfortable, armor, I would imagine. My spatial awareness is perfect. Uh, you crashed the last shuttle, you <laughs> Vega. <laughs> I need to feel my balance shift when I'm flying. Oh. Uh... You take that away. And... I don't know. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not me. Okay, that makes okay. sense. Plus, have you seen Tally? Come on, I don't have the hips to carry a suit like that. <laughs> I can't. I cannot. So you went into the Geth consensus? Yes. Like virtual reality? Yeah. yeah. It was strange, but I got out all right. That was wild, man. I mean, how would you know? How would I know what? If you really got out. See, if the Geth experience everything virtually, then you could only think you're in the real world. Don't mess with me like that, dude. Like, everything you're seeing now is a simulation. Don't mess with me like that. <laughs> Don't mess with me like that, man. I just got out. Oh, God. Shepard, you are now possibly the only living organic who has experienced the Geth consensus. I've done a lot of cool firsts. Different? It's fascinating. Mind-blowing. I'm also a bit thirsty. <laughs> And just like that, the magic is gone. Did you just say what I think you said? No. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, Edie. I love you, sweetie. I'm thirsty too. Joker's definitely been rubbing off on Edie. In more ways than one. All right, Edie. All right, Joker. See you later, kids. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> I want to go see what the other crewmates have to say about all this. You guys, did you see what I just did? I mean, you weren't there, but like, oh my god. Did you hear about what I just did? Am I in reality? I don't know what's happening. My mind is blown. I need to go lie down. <laughs> you know what? As much as I've been playing Mass Effect 3, I still sometimes get the urge to run into this door that's not there anymore. It's fine. Boop. We Oh yeah, we still have Dr. Chocolate's mission to do. Oh. So, oh. Prothean, huh? Oh, oh, okay. Yes. Uh, you guys like to drink, booze it up. Do you drink? Okay. What about gambling? Play cards? Oh no. Games of chance were punishable by death in the Empire. Oh. Oh sure, sure. That seems reasonable. reasonable. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, smoking, you ever do that? Only when my armor became inflamed. Right, <laughs> yeah, smoking. Oh my god! Some jokes then, you got jokes, all right. You got any good ones? No. Yes. Give them to me. Oh my god. Two Lomorian spy entered the enemy's camp and said to the Vanksher, I didn't know your barnabs could glow. Um... Um... That was the joke. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, he's trying to be chill. It. Yeah, that was a good. He has one. no idea what you're talking about, my dude. No, it wasn't. I just made it up. <gasps> the joke is now on you, human. You will believe it. Javik, don't be mean. Oh. Hey, Commander. Hi. James. What are you up to? So how's this going? Oh, cooking. Hope you don't mind. I was craving some of my Abuelas Huevos Rancheros. Ooh, sure can I have some? Them, they seem to work. Mmm. 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 Not as Yum. good as my Abuelas, but best thing I've had since I got on board. And maybe it's best I don't know what kind of eggs these are, no? It's probably not eggs. It's probably like rachnib chunks or something. Hello, Javik. You a great risk in allowing a machine access to your mind, Commander. What if they had infected you? Well, you know, nothing I could have done about it. All right, uh, you kids have fun. Save me some of those, okay? 
Garrus, boop. This platform can be of some <gasps> assistance, Garrus, for carrying him. Oh my god. I appreciate Legion and Garrus. Legion, but this is something I know a thing or two about. Oh my god. Telemetry data indicates the calibration of Normandy's weapon accuracy can be improved by 0.32%. Oh. That's all. You can't squeeze 0.34% out of it. Negative. That threshold is not. Garrus. <laughs> you sure? Take a look now. Scanning. Oh, Garrus. 0.43%. How did you accomplish this? A little secret we organics like to keep. Always hold some back for emergencies. No. <laughs> our current situation an emergency. A geth meddling with our computers, telling me how to do my job? No, oh. I can't imagine that would qualify. Uh-oh, uh-oh. So, Hi, Garrus. Geth reality, huh, Shepard? There are a lot of ways I can think of getting a few kicks in this universe. That's not one of them. I mean, I had fun with it when it was happening. Trust me, I had no clue. I mean, but you're, if you're thrown into a situation like that, it's like, well, might as well have fun with it. <laughs> you know what I mean? So who needs their ass kicked now? Oh, I got a laundry list of people. Do you want me to leave it for you? Here, I'll put it on your desk. Love you, Garrus. Kisses. These two. <laughs> On. <laughs> I'm loving all the different combos I'm seeing of people chatting every now and then. It makes me happy. Hi, Liara. The Geth would have analyzed any Prothean technology they came across. You're saying you found none? No. Oh. Which is not significantly greater than your own. That's too bad, but thank you for looking. Oh. Placed faith in us. We will do the same for Normandy. You mean the Normandy's crew? We do not see a meaningful distinction. Interesting. They see the crew as like part of the ship. That's fascinating. Can I just say also, I appreciate how courteous everyone's kind of being to Legion. I was expecting a lot more kind of backlash from some people because it's scary and unknown. So I'm very pleased that this is happening. All right, what new words of love and encouragement does my girlfriend have for me today? Perhaps we can talk later. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Okay, well. Okay, let's read the broker terminal. I'm just going to go cry in the corner. We have correspondence from classified... Alliance project staff, Dr. Locke, I was working on that problem you sent me last night and I think I found a solution for synchronizing the Crucible's energy bursts. Punch the attached capacitor redesign into your projections. It should shave 3.6 milliseconds off the mass effect field's activation time. You can see where that leads. If you approve, I'll send the schematics to manufacturing. We need roughly 250,000 by tomorrow morning for testing. Dr. Cole. Smuggler Manifest. Youngest system. Operative Morat has sent Smuggler Manifests of an Athabasca class freighter to authorities in the Youngest system. The manifest follows. 8,000 tons of dextro amino food supplies, 16,000 tons of levo amino acid food supplies, 200,000 tons of platinum stamped ingots, 12 Alliance fighter craft inactive mothballed on lower deck, 12 hierarchy interceptor craft inactive mothball on lower deck, 300 endangered workers, slaves from Karshan, recaptured attempting to escape reapers, mainly Batarian. Haven't the Batarians been through enough? Authorities will seize the freighter in two hours. Per the broker's request, the youngest government has agreed to provide the slaves asylum and oh, okay, and certificates of citizenship in exchange for future favors rendered okay. I hope you treat those people with respect because they shouldn't be slaves anymore. Because no one should be a slave. Boop. Okay, uh, bye, sweetie. Thanks for the riveting conversation. Love you. Kisses. Boop. Excellent find, Commander. The information network terminal has been updated. Okay, let's take a look. Boop. Ooh, improved geth resistors. Let's see. Shield strength bonus or power damage bonus? Ooh, I'm gonna do shields. Yep. Miniaturized armor capacitors. Shield shield bonus, power cooldown bonus. I'm gonna do cooldown bonus. Cause I feel like it. Okay, bye Glyph. Bye Liara. See you, sweetie. <laughs> Always lovely visiting my girlfriend who has nothing to say to me. Hi, Kaden. 
What the hell, Shepard? What just happened? I don't know, man. Actually, don't tell me. <laughs> I've got work to do, and I, I can't be distracted. What's up? I was plugged into the virtual world of the Geth consensus. Saw their history, purged a Reaper infection. Crap. Now I'll be obsessing about how that works, <laughs> instead of doing my Spectre Division expense report. <laughs> You're Sorry. Welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. You know, entering the Geth consensus is gonna be the best chapter in your autobiography. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Ready for the next mission. Whatever you got. Sounds good, Caden. Wow, he's really got the best view in the whole ship. See you, dude. Good luck with your, your busy work. Does not sound very fun. Boop. Hello, everybody. I'm just gonna do the awkward thing where I run a lap and then leave. Boop. Without talking to anybody. <laughs> it's fine. Hello, everybody. Not sure what to think about that little mech dog roaming the ship. Robo Puppy is very cute. Oh, she's cute. Sophie. Oh. Look how long I've been with you. Oh snap! Oh my god! Oh my god! Amazing! Amazing! That was awesome. Asari, who were turned into Reaper creatures. Just the listening Arnold in on your conversation. You know. I think that story would be perfect for you. The hidden dark side of the most beautiful race in the galaxy. We have a huge Asari audience. If I do that story, I could lose them. That seems a bit like pandering. Ever seen how fast an e-democracy can abandon its allies? No. If I do my job, you won't. Interesting. Okay, bye. Now that IB's dropped, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> Later, Tato. Hello. Dude, face covering, for God's you know, sake. Like Citadel, I think I might hit a nightclub. You should join me. Hell yeah, Cortez, I'll go clubbing with you. Hey, you flew that Geth fighter out of the dreadnought? Actually, Legion did the piloting. Mm -hmm. I was stuck in a storage compartment with my squad. Yep. Would have loved more time with that ship. Too bad we sent it to hack its team so quickly. I just, I hate how close I he is. Say, I enjoyed that last <laughs> mission on Rannoch. Is everything okay, Shepard? No, it's not okay, my dude. I need you to start wearing protective gear. You're literally blinding yourself. Okay, I need to leave. <laughs> I need to leave. <gasps> ah! Oh, Robo Puppy's name is Sophie. Hello, puppy. It's so cute. I think it's time to go back to the Citadel and turn a few things in. I think that's a good course of action next. All right, to the Citadel. Goodbye, Rannoch. We will be back at some point to do that priority mission. Wee! Citadel time! Boop. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Hmm. I'll go to the embassies. I need to get to the embassies. Sure. Yes, Commander. Let's go there first. Hi, everybody. I'm back. <laughs> Did you miss me? Hi. Hi, everybody. Hi. How's it going? All right. Let's see if I can turn anything in on this floor. There's so many people. It's these two again. is, and I'm gonna be deployed soon too. Everyone's been called back to active duty since Earth was attacked. I understand, but I can't leave my daughter here alone. I need to send her back to Thessia. To How her old is her daughter? Is my question. Complicated, and usually take a very long time. It's even worse with everything going on right now. I'm very sorry. If you can't accept a fostering by proxy until her file is processed... Fostering by proxy? Yeah, There's always a Turian trying to run into me, man. You know... Your side of the family. What? Are you kidding? My family disowned me when I married Neota. Wanna guess why? What? Why? They'd be happier to see those Cerberus assholes than they would be to see me. Wow. I not wish to send your daughter to them. Yeah, well. Your understanding doesn't help me or my daughter much right now. Dang. 
All right, so I'm going to try going to the hospital. See if there's anything here I can turn in. Oh, whoa, there's people on the ground. What the hell? Oh, my God. She's got this glow in the reapers. We did uh. She's covered in Glowing. She reaches out. Her eyes go black. And she touches one of the farmers and he just dies. They panic. She rips them apart. Sometimes touching, sometimes opening them up with bionics. Oh my god. Liquid. And I'm there in my towel with no gun. Oh my and god. Pouring through the door. Goddess. So I ran. Jeez. Her story just keeps getting worse and worse. Oop. The hospital is not in great shape. Like, it's really not. Boop. <laughs> it's a mess. Ooh. There's the doctor. Boop. I overheard what you said. Yes. I found this at a Cerberus station. A poison Turians. Found see. it. Yes, I think this is it. With these schematics, we should be able to come up with an antidote. Nice. The general might pull through because of this. Awesome! Hooray! Boop. Yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. He's already awake and responsive. Yay! We did a thing. Boop. We did a thing. We did a thing. We saved a life and possibly more. Do 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 do. Bye everybody. Uh good luck. I know the Citadel's in disarray right now, but we're doing our best. Boop. Status recognized. Thank you. Okay, let's go to the Presidium Commons. One Boop. moment, please. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm back. Remember me? Just gonna run around. Oh, oh, oh. Scientist. Boop. I think I know which project you mean. Mm -hmm. And I've got a Hesperia period statue in bay D24. Yes. That's excellent news. I'll have it sent to that project right away. Thank you so much for your help. You're welcome. Boop. So what were you able to pull from the inscriptions? Really? Excellent. I knew they'd find something. Nice. Right on. Anything else? No. I think the other stuff will be over meow. How is everyone? We running around the citadel, turning in some stuff. I found some things while on my travels. Would you like to have them? I love that every time I come here, none of these fires have been put out. Back to the chaos of the docks. It seems to get more chaotic every time I show up. Okay. I'm saving purgatory for last, by the way, so we can, you know, blow off some steam with the club, you know? Hi, everybody. How's it going? Hi. Okay, it's this one again. Nope. It's okay. I mean, they'll get here. This no, poor girl. The next shuttle was probably just late or something. Yeah. That's all. Um, excuse you. <laughs> it's that guy again. I thought he was just over there. He's over here now. Is this the same guy? Oh no, it's another one. What the? <laughs> Why? Hello, can I help you? Okay, anyways. <laughs> oh, man. So good. Hi, boys. Oh, wow, James stopped gambling. Good for him. Dun, 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 dun. One thing I'm going to check for is where Miranda is, because I know she's going to be around here somewhere. Hi, Kelly. I, the horrible thing service, did you? I mean, Felicia. That's not the organization I joined. <laughs> we love you, Felicia. Hi, James. James? What are you doing? Man. What brings you down here? Oh, he's getting tatted. Okay, I was like, you then. what happened? Well, after our little chat, I made up my mind. I'm going to join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? There you go. <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. Interesting. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Is he getting N7 tattooed on just him? I'm an N7 recruit, but, you know. I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail, right? 
Wait, wait, you're training up? But I wouldn't exactly <laughs> say I'm training. When do I have time? Not officially. <laughs> what the hell is in this goddamn war? I mean... I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you. And you know, I'll take whatever advice Stop you get. Stop moving. Really? <laughs> sure. The good advice. Sure, welcome to the program. Proud well, of you. I wouldn't ask you if they didn't think you could handle it. Proud Here's of you, James. Hope. But the real work starts now. Ooh, you tell him, uh -huh. Shep. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Okay. Clearly. <laughs> I won't let you down. Don't let yourself down. The person you need to prove yourself to is the one standing in the mirror mm -hmm. every morning. Yep. Good point. You know, that's going to sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Yeah, I'll be fine. Always. Put some Sanoderm on it. Maybe we should get magic. <laughs> you want me to yes! get a tattoo? N7? Yes! Sure. Or you could get my name done. Somewhere special. James. You're such a tease, Vega. Oh my Ooh, god. <laughs> You're gonna make good on all this flirting. <gasps> uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... Oh my go. god! I was just... That's what I thought. Oh my god. Later, <laughs> Lieutenant. Later. Shepard! Careful. Oh. My god. She just beat James at his own game. She just took the flirtation and just cranked it up to 11. That was amazing. Yay. What's up, Zaid? You know the current leader of the Suns? What's up, dude? Don't remind me. Don't remind me. Little scumbag shot his mouth off on a patrol mission once. Got half his squad killed. Real popular after that. Good job. We couldn't boot him from the suns fast enough. Should have ended his tenure with a bullet. Wow, this guy does not have much respect. If Zaid thinks you're the scum of the earth, you've got some serious work to do. Aww, I wanted to get a matching tattoo with James. That would have been fun. It's okay. We'll do it another time. If you have a question, Please consult an Avena terminal for assistance. I don't have a question. I'd like to go to the next floor. Thank One you. Moment, please. Thank you. I'd like to go to the club. And blow off some steam. Now Anyhow, enough about my armor. Let's Hi. Let's gang and celebrate while I'm still here. Where'd you park? These two have been here for a minute. The fanciest ride on the Citadel. Wait, he's wearing Cerberus colors. I, uh, I sold it a couple of weeks ago. Uh. What? But you love that car. I know. You never shut up about that car. <laughs> I know. Let's go, baby. Boop. What's up, Purgatory? Your most famous regular is here. Let's go dancing. Hey, Asus Chaps Lady. What's up? Every bar and club has their staples, and Asus Chaps Lady is the one. <gasps> ooh, 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 it's Joker and Edie again. Ooh, ooh. Should I interrupt? Why can't I talk to Edie? Oh no! Why can't I talk to Edie? Oh no! What's wrong? Oh, Boo. Oh, it's bugged. I can't talk to her. That's okay. Well, Commander Shepard showed up again, everybody. Doing circles. That's, that's her signature move. Just ignore her. She'll leave. Eventually. <laughs> Whee! Hey, it's these two. Hi, I'm eavesdropping. You've been watching the news? Sure. You know what's happening to Earth while we're sitting here? Calm down already. Ooh. Cortez! Sure, made it. Come have a drink with me. Yes, hell yeah. You're looking happy. Oh. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. I'd love to see him having fun. I'm not wasting it. Yes. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your taste. <laughs> I mean... You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. <laughs> There's an energy here. There's light. Oh. And purgatory serves the best drinks. Oh, you know it. Here. Oh, to our friendship, to a new day. I'm going to say to our friendship. Hey, and to you, Shepard. A good friend when I needed one most. Oh, my God. This is so wholesome. For everything. Oh, Cortez, I'm happy for you. See you back on the Normandy. 
Okay, he's like, all right, I need to go uh, try and meet some people. I don't need my boss hanging around, making it awkward. <laughs> See ya. Unsa, unsa, unsa. Yes, all right. It's time for Drunk Auntie at a Wedding, number 1063. Let's go. Oh, snap. Ooh, <laughs> that girl. <laughs> More. Yes. Amazing. <laughs> Shepard just spaced out and came to and that lady was just grinding on the wall. Ah, well that was much needed. Time to go. Thank you, Purgatory. Rage fest as always. Let's go to the dock. Thank you. That's the last place we haven't gone yet. All right. You're sure of what you saw? Yes, Sergeant. Heard from your brother since then? No, Sergeant. All right, Talavi. I'll see if I can get you fighting Reapers instead of Cerberus. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. You won't thank me so much when you're eye deep in husks. Yeah, let me tell you from first-hand experience, it's really not that fun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, boop. I recovered Prothean data drives from Garbug. I'll have them brought here. Oh, we got a lot of credits for that. Thank you. I'm sure that'll help with uh, any operation we have going. <laughs> He's like, I almost spilled the beans. Thank you, good sir. So the question is, where is Miranda? Oh my God. Oh, I forgot Jacob's here. Wait, Jacob's in the patient lounge of the hospital. Okay, we've got to go back and see what our favorite person has for us. <laughs> Miranda's around here somewhere. Oh, she was in the Presidium Commons and we missed her. All right, we're back at the hospital because we have one more important person to see here before we go. Where is he? Maybe he's inside the actual hospital. Oh, he's waiting in line. Hey, Shepard. Hey. I'm glad to see you. I know things are crazy right now. How's it going? Exactly. So you have to take the moments when you can. I like that his email to me was like, man, things are getting so stressful with my new girlfriend. You want to meet a, for a drink? <laughs> oh God, the coughing and hooing in the background is lovely ambiance. All right, let's investigate. Progress on the Crucible. What's going on with the Crucible? That project is crazy. Freaking huge. It has to and be. All these brilliant minds are working night and day trying to figure it out. I wish you could see them. Heads down, piecing it together. It's something to see. We'll get this crucible built, Shepard. And then we'll win this thing. I feel it. Do you feel it? Can you feel it? Sure. I feel it. Sure. And I'm counting on you <laughs> and everyone there. Get it done. Get it done, Believe Jacob. So what is he actually doing at the crucible? Is my question. Like, what is his job? Let's see. How is Dr. Cole? It was interesting to meet Bryn. How is I haven't she? really asked him what he's She's doing. Great, it's good to see her work without the distraction of having to worry about the colony. Mm -hmm. And you and her? We're... <gasps> we're having a baby, Shepard. What? Wow. Congratulations. What? Wasn't exactly planned, but uh, I'm looking forward to it. Oh. I'm going to be a better father than mine was. Well, you damn well better be. He was pretty horrible. It's, uh... <laughs> wow. One more thing to fight for. You got that right. Oh, good for them. For really? What? Yeah. <laughs> Shepherd. What? That's <laughs> nice. What? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna talk her out of it. No offense. Okay. None, None taken. taken, dude. Good. Also, that's my last name. <laughs> Why does she want to name the baby after me? That's weird. Is that weird? Also, my name is Nix. Not Sh uh, Okay, you know. And how are you? You're gonna be a dad. So what's going on with you? you, you he just like told you. <laughs> Things are good. I'm good. Still not tempted to come back to the Normandy? He's got Always things to do. <laughs> but no. So, you working on the Crucible? <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Uh, I'm smart. But not that smart. But Packet keeps me busy, though. What is he doing? How's he doing? Holding up. If they make old guys any tougher than that, I'd like to see it. Hackett's a G. All right, dude. 
Well, I thought we were going to go get a drink, but apparently we're just standing here and talking in a hospital. So, um, congratulations, and um, I should go. I'm glad we had time to talk. Me too. Gotta take the moments when you can. So true. Uh huh. And Shepard, thanks again for getting my people out alive. Take care, Jacob. You too, Shepard. I'm thinking about you out there. Stay safe. Thank you. Cool. It's good to see ya. He's just... What is he looking at? He's looking out the window. Okay, Jacob. You take care, dude. We gotta go back to the Presidium Commons because I missed Tali and that is not acceptable. Boop. We. This ad for Purgatory is probably my favorite thing on this floor because it's completely demonic looking. There has to be some Ooh. way for us to get more medical supplies. Tali! I told you already, we have nothing to spare. Support Tali! Tali Always! Saved the Citadel a couple years ago. Watch your tone. Ooh! Don't you back sass her. We don't have enough Metagel for our own needs. We can't help your people right now. I'm sorry. Damn it. Thank you for trying to help. Thank you for trying, I guess. Oh, that was it. I can't talk to her. That's okay. She's busy. Love you, Tali. You're amazing, sweetie. Where is Miranda? Boop. Oh, there she is. Is this about your sister? Hello. Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. Uh, what? I've barely seen you or spoken to you and you show up and you have that. What? You have this request? What? What is like it? Miranda. Just tell me what's going on. Come on, girl. At least you can I do is be up front. It. If that's a problem, I'll go. Don't. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. <sighs> I trust you. It's not that simple. I'm really not sure why at this point she doesn't want to give me any information about why she needs access. It's a little bit suspect. I feel like she was kind of telling me things all along a little bit and now she's giving me nothing. I'm like, is she being watched? Is there more to it? It's not that I distrust Miranda necessarily, it's more that the fact that she's not telling me anything is making me uneasy. That she was loyal in Mass Effect 2, she hasn't really given me a reason not to trust her, so I guess I'll say I trust you. You'll have your access, Miranda, but I don't like the sound of this. Yeah, I, I don't either. And thank you. It means a lot. That's not the only thing you wanted to talk about, is it? No. I need to tell you something. Okay, what's up? Confess. Really? It's been eating away at me. Okay. Confess. <sighs> When I headed the Lazarus Project to rebuild you, I wanted to implant a control chip in you as a safeguard. I think you mentioned this. Uh huh. I did. There's more to it. Mm hmm. The elusive man stopped me. This is an interesting time to tell me this. <laughs> interesting. Stopped? Sounds like it would have saved him a lot of trouble. Maybe. He didn't want to interfere with who you truly were. Interesting. Had just obeyed orders. He wanted Commander Shepard. I mean, installing the chip might have ruined you. I don't know if I want to say you were cautious. Like, I don't think there was a reason to implant a control chip in me. I don't like the sound of that at all. I'm glad she's telling me this, like, way after the fact. Like, thank you for telling me, I guess. But, like, Okay. Normally I would go with the nicer option, but part of me wants to say I'm not a slave. I'm glad the elusive man stopped you and everything, but you were thinking about it. And I can understand that at the time they were probably worried about how Shepard was going to behave, like what I would do, but yeah, I've got to say it. I'm not a slave. I'm glad you didn't. Better to stay dead than be someone's plaything. Yep. Exactly. Why bring that up now? I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me, right down to my bloody DNA. After I got out of there, I couldn't stand by and let it happen to my sister. I risked my life to get her away from all that. 
Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. Interesting. This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have taken everything from me, made me a prisoner. But you didn't. I don't know how, but you brought me back. Thanks. But with so much being uncertain, I just wanted you to know I always regretted wanting that chip. I appreciate that. Thanks, but it's okay. What's done is done. Um, I mean, knowing that she regrets it now is important. It's not like she's standing by it and being like, you know, I stand by my choice. She regrets it. And I appreciate that. I appreciate her communicating that to me. It is interesting how the Reaper invasion is bringing out a lot of people to confess things or vocalize things they may not have vocalized before or take chances they may not have taken before. Like, I don't know if Joker and Edie would be a couple if this, was, this wasn't happening. So it's been interesting to see. I'll say thanks, but it's okay. I mean, there's nothing you can really change now. You can't keep beating yourself up over the past. And you regret it, I so. I don't, but this was important. Some things you just don't have control over. Guess my fancy genetics can't help me there. No, they can't. Nope. Okay. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. No worries. And Miranda, this thing you have to do. Good luck. Don't worry, Shepard. I always have a plan. Every time I meet up with Miranda, I feel like she's going to actually ask for my help. And each time she kind of really hasn't. I mean, she asked for like access to information, but I haven't like gone on a mission to help her or anything yet. So I hope she stays safe out there. Ooh, wait, how did I miss this? There's an angry accountant somewhere. Oh, here we go. Boop. I recovered the Book of Plenix. Yes. Earth Clan. This is a priceless gift. I did a thing. I Thank did a you. thing. You may help my people remember themselves. Nice. That's awesome. We Nice. Well, now that we've turned in some things, let's go and do that last little N7 mission before we end for the day. One moment, please. Thank you. We I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. Oh, okay. <laughs> the Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. Okay. It's a low-gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? Oh, jeez. Are we playing security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not. Okay. <laughs> That's cool, I guess. Boop. Thank you again, Commander. I appreciate the assist. You're welcome. Goodbye, Citadel. Boop. N7 fuel reactors. A vital depot has gone silent, leaving Allied fleet short on desperately needed fuel. Investigate the depot and get it operational again. All right, to the map. Boop. All right, let's see. Where are you hiding? Aha. Fuel reactors. Boop. Alright kids, who are we taking this time? Shall we do boy squad this time and do like Caden and James? That could be fun. Let's do Caden. Potato, you're up. And James. And boop. Shepard has one point, so I can't level her up anymore. Caden has nine points. I'm going to level up Barrier to rank five. Increase shield regeneration rate by 15% while Barrier is active. Increase damage and force by 25% while Barrier is active. Um, I'm going to increase the shield regeneration rate. James has 18 points. I'm going to fully level up Fortification. To rank six, we have reduce power speed penalty by 30% or increase damage protection by 10%. I'm gonna do power speed penalty. I'm also going to level up 
frag grenade to rank four, increase damage by 30% or increase impact radius by 30%. Let's do impact radius. And then I'm gonna level up incendiary ammo to rank two and rank three. Nice. Let's go. Shepard, about 72 hours ago, the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Scans of the station are cold. It's deserted. Okay. What happened to the troop station there? Mm -mm. Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. Oh, that's not good. Get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. Okay. Captain Riley's on site doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good. Hack it out. Sweet. Commander. Corporal Nyrek reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. Hello. Hi, I just pointed my gun. God, Shepard, chill. <laughs> um, why do I only have my pistol equipped? What the hell? I didn't unequip anything. That's weird. I'm gonna get this chest plate. Is that the way this mission goes? Do I just have a pistol equipped? All right, you know what? I don't really feel like going back and fixing this, so we're just gonna roll with it. Well, looks like I'm uh, charging and slamming my way through this. This is gonna be fun. Hello. This is chaotic. Boop. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Pointing a gun Three at him, having a conversation. Thick and thicker. The captain always sees us through. Stay sharp today. Always, Commander. With my little pistol. All right. Na, 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 na. Let's go, boys. Na, 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 na. Hello. We need a radiation workaround, soldier. On it, ma'am. Boop. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Hello. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Sounds good, Cortez. Right, the fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Sounds good. Thank you. I'll take it from here. I'm just gonna hide. Oh my god. Doing so many backflips. I mean, at least I've got two pretty strong fighters with me. Thank goodness. <laughs> That's good. Ooh. Oh, that ain't good. That looks nasty. Boop. A treatment plan for chemical burns. Ooh. This is pretty detailed. Ouch. Hello. Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting access to most of the grid. Survival in hotspots, not possible. Okay. So... Radiation proximity warning. Oh, pfft. <laughs> he didn't even finish his sentence! <laughs> I was dead! I thought I could run through it, because I saw stuff down there. Oh, no. Hell yeah. <laughs> Amazing! Commander Shepard went through all this just to die from some poisonous gas. Hello again. Enemy here, Captain. How's it going? My team will help send him to hell. Please disregard that silly mistake I just made. Two, Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. Cool, sounds good. <laughs> Crane display. <laughs> what is this? Spare parts. Nice. Ooh, what's this? Boop. Let's see. Directional guidance error. Oh. Team two moving out, Commander. Good luck, Captain. Something's Ooh. not right here. Uh -oh. Yeah, I feel like we're being watched. Just stay sharp, people. Ooh. Something is weird. Crane. <laughs> Interesting. I don't really know what's happening, but like, all right, what was I supposed to do? There we go. Boop. I think that worked. So this made it over there. Okay, I put it down. Did that do anything? So I have an alternate route now, I just don't know how to get there. Where is the next crate? Oh, 
here we go. There we go. Oop. Oop. Did that do anything? Oh, here we go. Radiation is blocking access. Here we go. Situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. Boop. This looks like ventilation control. Yes. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. There we go. Yes. Yay, we can go down there without dying now. <laughs> Let's go. Boop. Yes, I leveled up. Fuel rods unlocked here. Wait a minute. Uh oh. Commander, Captain, tracking movement in your areas. Oh no no no. Positions. Enemy inbound. Oh dear. Oh, this weapon's awful. <laughs> this weapon's awful. No. Marauder. Get out of my face. You know. Don't touch him! Ooh, you nasty. <laughs> this weapon's terrible! <laughs> oh no! Riley, status. One casualty, but we're clear here. Warning. Coolant leak. Oh dear. Boop. System restart impossible. Uh oh. You both have to seal all the moderator tanks. Uh oh. I see the reactor two tanks moving to seal. All right, let's go. We. <laughs> I have the worst weapon equipped. Oh no! Quick, boop. All right, we got one. Next. Oh god. Only one more to go here. Sick. Hello. You guys really caught me at a disadvantage today. You're welcome. Quick, boop. Woohoo! Commander, the core is stabilized. Reactivation can go ahead. Nice. Riley, you in position? Affirmative. Awaiting your word. Let's go. <laughs> Boop. Boop. Initiating restart. <laughs> Yay! I'm reading a lot of movement. Headed your way. Oh, goody. Incoming. Here we go. Woohoo! Love it. No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god, amazing. Hello? No, bad husk. <laughs> I have the worst weapon! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Taking me forever to shoot them. <laughs> Hi. No. Bad Marauder, no. 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 Boom. Wee. Fun times. Excuse me. No. Nice. Oh. Hi. No, bad husk. Chaos. Hell. Hello. Boom. Commander, we're being overrun. Oh no. We're not gonna make it. I'm sending help. Hold tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. Oh god. Um Kaden, you're up, buddy. <laughs> Go on, Kaden. You got this, buddy. Oh, my God. A brute. And I have the worst weapon imaginable. Oh, no. Why? No. It's a bad brute. No. No. Oh, it's a bug. Hello. Boom. Boom. There we go. <laughs> bad Brutus. Hello. Can I help you? Hi. Lord. Can't 
race, Captain Riley. <gasps> what about Caden? Oh, no, Caden. No one's answering my hail. <laughs> but I'm tracking some movement toward the pickup point. Finalize the restart, then we can rendezvous there. Oh my god, Caden. Okay. Initiate final start up. Let's go, quick. Boop. Get up, Shepard. Get up. This is not the time for flips. Boop. Boop. Commander. Oof. Oh, quick extraction point. Come on, James. Let's go. <laughs> quick. Run. Where is Caden? Caden, I don't want you to be a roasted potato. Are you okay? Oof. He's okay. He's okay. Commander, you saved our asses. Wait. My team is in your debt. Oh, God. Thank Major Alenko. Just doing my job. Yay. Caden's okay. Okay, bye. Well done. Report back to the shuttles. Nice. I did it all with the worst weapon imaginable. <laughs> Yay. Down there, Shepherd. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating I mean... a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. Oh, I read they will. Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. We did it. I'll keep you posted on new developments. Hack it out. Bye, hack it. Nice. 10,000 credits. Not too shabby. <laughs> I can't believe we were on our last mission of the day and somehow, it must have been a bug or something, but it reset my weapon to the worst pistol and nothing else. I just had that one pistol. So it was a nice change of pace. You know, I like to keep things exciting around here. <laughs> Complete chaos, you know. We made it. That's what's important. I mean, the, the funny thing is, is I actually died from the toxic gas, not because of my gun. <laughs> Commander Shepard, hero of the universe, died from walking into toxic gas that was very clearly dangerous. That was quite a day. I was expecting to kind of just do some regular side missions and we ended up doing a really intense rescue mission. And then that second mission with Legion was amazing. Like such a dive into the lore. As I said, I was not expecting that today. It was like so different from anything we've done in the game so far. And it explained so much about the Quarians and the Geth. Like I literally sat there afterwards and was like mind blown by it and trying to process <laughs> everything I had just seen. I'm not really sure what we'll do next time because there's still stuff we can pick up from planet scanning. We've got a couple DLCs. We have quite a few options right now. It was really nice after Priority Perseus Veil to not just go straight on to the next priority. I'm glad we had some more time with the Corians and helping them out before the next big mission. I'm still shocked by the fact that we have Geth in our ranks now. Like what is happening? What is life? Things are getting so much more intense and Mass Effect 3 is really bringing to fruition. So many storylines and things we thought we understood in 1 and 2, our viewpoints are being shifted. I'm basically just trying to knock things off my list. Now we've got this Quarian war on top of everything. So just another day in the life of Commander Shepard trying to juggle the whole universe. It's just the way it is. Thanks so much for joining me for Mass Effect 3. If you're enjoying this playthrough and want to see more, go ahead and let me know by hitting the thumbs up and leaving me a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications button on your way out so you can be notified new videos go up. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.